Yeah, this was a good pickup, y'all. Happy about this. Big Kenworth T8. Well, I'd love to take this thing off his hands. <laughs> C12 in there sound good. Suspension on here. The best thing about buying a truck from somebody you know, y'all, is a truck that's been around locally that you know about. He can tell me everything about the truck. What's going on fam, it's your boy Al. Y'all tune back in with them Jennings boys, man, and we back with another video for y'all, man. Make sure y'all stop what y'all doing. Go hit that subscribe button, hit that post notification bell, man. Like this video, man. make sure y'all stop and like the video, man. Run the likes up, and we gonna keep running these numbers on up, man. We back on the road again, man. Back with another exciting video for y'all, man. I told y'all I gonna keep bringing y'all this trucking content, this dump trucking content. So in today's video, you wouldn't believe, man, we hopefully going to buy another dump truck, y'all. Uh, we heading out, uh, going to check out this. Well, I've already seen the truck before. I've actually been trying to buy this truck for the past two or three years. Um, it's an older gentleman that had the truck. Um, he's retiring. He was supposed to retire, I think, a year or two ago, but I think he kept driving and kept driving. So now he just randomly got a, I randomly got a call today saying he was ready to sell the truck. So. I stopped what I do I was doing and we heading straight out here to check this truck out and uh hopefully bring it back home man it's uh Kenworth I don't even know what year it is you know they all look the same so it's a Kenworth T8 um it's like a baby blue color I know that it's got an aluminum bed on a six axle it's got a C12 motor in it uh, I forget how long I think he's had it since it was new maybe I have to ask him when we get out here but since I've gotten to the trucking uh, game this guy has had this truck, so this truck's been around for a long time. I've been seeing it for a long time now. I know the guy took care of the truck as well, so I know the truck is in good shape. I remember I was trying to buy it from him before, and he said he wasn't he wasn't selling it until he fixed everything on the truck. So we're gonna get out here and check it out. I know he redid the whole floor in stainless steel, like the other trucks we just did. So it's got a new stainless steel floor. Um, I think all he did with the truck is asphalt so the truck is asphalt ready you know that's what we specialize in so it's gonna all work out perfect man we're getting ready to head out here and we're about five minutes away now y'all so make sure y'all stay tuned and we're gonna be showing y'all again how to purchase a dump truck man so man get out y'all's uh pen and pad man take notes man a lot of y'all been asking me questions about these dump trucks and stuff man keep asking me questions y'all that's what i'm here for man to educate y'all and bring y'all this free game, man. And we, we actually, them Jennings boys, that we actually got another <laughs> actual Jennings, Jennings boy, boy. <laughs> For real, man. with us today. So, What's going on? yeah, we're getting ready to go out here. I'm kind of excited. Like I said, uh, I've been trying to get this truck for a while now, y'all. So, let's get on out here and see it. And the truck ain't even hit the market. So, like I told y'all before, man, that's the best way to buy trucks before it hit the market, man. And, and finding out about trucks that's going to be getting posted for sale or guys that's interested in selling their trucks before they hit the market y'all so yeah just stay tuned like i said go like this video and if you ain't already subscribed man you better get subscribed because man, we got all kind of dump truck content coming up man crazy dump truck content man on on site uh on the job sites and all kind of crazy fun stuff so stay tuned man this it y'all where the fuck we at pull in and see what this looks like somewhere with somebody a part of a dump truck though i just ain't trying to get shot you feel me <laughs> we out here not get shot land and they not gonna hear it he said ain't nobody gonna hear it gonna get buried in the back we might be one off though i think we 
might be that one over there. We gonna find out once we turn around up here. Yeah, this is like a farm. Yes, like it's the wrong place. Two five five twos over there. Then he just he just passed us, didn't he? Farmland. Farmland, you hear me? Siri don't never be bad on these addresses, bro. Are you in the wrong turn, movie? Damn. What? Deer? ID. Oh. I'm gonna fuck with these bones. <laughs> Cuz we need to get them out of here. He done dissected. He <laughs> done with bones. Stick with bones, man. Truff right there. That mother's water, though. It don't matter, bro. That's the truck right here, y'all. She's pretty. It's pretty much the same. It ain't changed. <laughs> You've had this truck forever, haven't you? 18 years, I think. 18 years. What year have you ever since? It's a 97. 97? It's got a in it, right? Yep. Okay. This thing's clean. Shiny. Shiny ass, you know. Not white, no smoke coming out of it. Let's get it. Man, look like it raises up to it. clean in there too. That's good to see. Okay, yeah, bed looks good. Tarp and then the tarp was new last year. Okay. Good. The motor on the tarp was new last year. Front tires were new in the season they haven't been on. Okay. Night tires got a year on them, I think. Okay. Central still. You done anything to the motor since you had it? No. Well, yeah, since I've had it. Uh, we overhauled it. It was four and a quarter, I think it had on it. Okay. Now I'm thinking it's got something like 850 on it. But I'm not. 850, okay. So this car, I know some of them start, stop spinning after so long. And... Yeah. Man, this thing is. I popped the hood. Yep. Got it. Look good, bed look good, raises up really. How supposed you got to? All asphalt, didn't you? Nothing yeah. but asphalt. That's so, all there. Yeah. It's 
big bee right there. Ooh. So what are Jay doing? He working? He's out working right now. They're working up in uh somewhere about an Intel job, Clover Valley Road and yep. They were doing some mill and fill right there on one of those roads. Clover Valley, and I forget what the other road is. Clover Valley. Now getting cut. Is that the automatic greasing system or is it is this old? Yeah, it's automatic. Automatic. Oh, man, that's a good cool. That's a good beer. Well, I'd love to take this thing off your hands. <laughs> it's really. um, the most oil it's ever used was, a, was on the head at uh, 3,000 miles. And I was running down the hill, so I doubt you'll okay. see that. Right, you right. Keep an eye on it. Okay. And I'm thinking that the reason that it started using that is because I, you know, I just saw a fair lot of synthetic oil in there that I didn't know it had. Uh -huh. So I ran a couple of years ago, I ran it from a synthetic to a so blended, synth right. semi synthetic. Uh -huh. And then I went back, back to the other hotel. One after that. Right. Just regular. Okay. So if you run synthetic in it, it may fix that. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, all the, all the seats we got, we, all the trucks we got, we run just the regular Rotella in them. I haven't uh, really had any, any experience with running this synthetic. Everybody's always told me just to get the regular. That's good. It's man. been a good one. It, when I bought it, it wasn't very good. Back then, you could buy good parts and I replaced everything that came with parts. Right. It's been a good job. She, uh, how she drives? Pretty smooth? Yeah, it's been good. Enough. I would I would like to. <laughs> I thought I would love to. I would like to. I mean, if we can. Yeah, well, there's no uh, insurance. I, I, I would just go probably up the road and back real quick. I think Paul Ryan would be doing that. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. I mean, I, I trust you. I, I figure the truck is solid. Like I said, I've seen you in the truck every day. <laughs> so I've been, I started driving. I think I started driving in 2013, so. So I dropped that upside. We're over there, man. Move that uh, pickup truck out the way. Right. So Al's taking the truck, hold on. So Al's taking the truck with the owner. He's doing a test drive. And he gonna come back and tell us the results of how it runs, how it feels, how it rolls, how everything works. So we'll talk to y'all when we get back. I ain't wanna cut the camera off too early, but you know, just wanna show y'all everything that's going on. I don't want y'all feel left out or anything like that. I got the dog barking at me, but I mean, something I ain't already used to, you know? But yeah, well, I'll talk to y'all in a second and we gonna tell y'all the results. Look nice, I love the color, y'all. That color is beautiful. I am not gonna lie, and it wouldn't mind. Won't look bad at nothing. Fleet. All right, brother. Let me back up. Let me back up. <laughs> or I could have just backed up more, but all right. Hey. Whip skills got. Let's see what this man whip skills is, man. And one truck that comes if you can give it to our <laughs> All right, I'm about to go back out there and see what they're talking about. So let me go in and get on that.
thousand. Okay. You want cash, cashier's check? What do you prefer? Oh, do you have a notary or anything for the title? I've got one. This is a bank, yeah. That close to here. Johnstown. Truck. Drive, I like this color, man. This color is it's beautiful. It's just a 97. 97. Hey, this is a 97? Jeez, please. This mug green. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful. What's that one? Yeah. Yeah, those machines look good. The arm looks new right here, too. The problem Yeah. The expensive ones now are some of the older trucks are weird. Some of the parts are hard to get. I got one, we got one truck done, and it was. I can't remember how much they charge us for it. It was ridiculous compared to what prices used to be. It was over $3,000. Yeah, I believe it. I got three axles done. I think it was like eight grand in one truck. Yeah, the prices now are triple what they used to be. I think all the up, all the down bags, I believe, were changed last year. Okay. It's ready to go to work. Never looks like it's ready to go to work. I can tell you. Now the through shaft was, he was looking at it last winter and he could get a little bit of slop on it moving in and out. And he figured and I figured that those were, were taking roller bearings of a wheel bearing uh -huh. and you, you load that with the, with the yoke nut. But these aren't like that, they're a flat lower bearing. Okay. So that can slide in low a little bit, doesn't hurt anything. Okay. I was figuring we were going to have, have a problem. Right. So we pulled it off, put, pulled the yoke out, put a new seal in it, and put it back together, and put a new nut on it. So okay. it should be, should be solid. Should be run for years. Right. Looks good. The transmission has gone through the year before last. Clutch was changed at the same time. Okay. So there's. It's greased, ready to go for the year. Okay. And greased everything except the tailgate. Okay. As far as that grease system goes, you just want to watch. And they say to make sure there's, it looks damp around all the grease joints. Right. Where do you put the grease in that for the automatic ones? Oh, this thing right here. Because I had one and I, it was, I had to take it all off because it was just so much of a pain in the butt because it was. See that thing there? Put that into your air. Okay. That quick attach there. That's this right here. The quick attach on the, the thing sticking straight down, straight down. The brass looking thing. Here. Take this thing off here. Okay. You Put that on there. there. It's uh, you got to kind of get used to it. It's not okay. the easiest thing in the world to do. Okay. You put pressure on it. You can't hardly do anything with it. Okay. So you got to put it on with no pressure and then bleed the air off 
pressure off of it before you take it back off. But it's there ain't no guarantees on it if you have any problems with it. Oh, that's your problem. <laughs> it's as is. <laughs> that's what any truck you buy. Well, I, I really don't I, expect you to have any problem with it. I'm more comfortable that. buying a truck from you that I've seen this truck around and going to buy a truck from a complete stranger. <laughs> that's probably one of the most right. dependable trucks that I've ever had. Right, right. This thing's clean too. These parts these days are made cheap, cheaper than they used to be. <laughs> you can't buy good parts. No, it's, it's ridiculous. You used to be able to go to Columbus County and get the same parts that came on that truck. Right. You can't now. Right. It's junk. Yeah, everything is junk now. Every, and the prices are triple. Quality's down, the price is up. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah. All right, I'm going to get back get back down here to Columbus and make it over to the bank. Nobody can let them know to get that cash for me. I'll be here at 10 in the morning. Okay. Yep, I appreciate you. Right. Appreciate you. Thank you. My headlight there has got moisture in it, but it still works. Okay. That's the cool. You okay, too. Take care. I'll be here in the morning. First thing. What's up, Mr. Farmer? Oh, <laughs> yeah, we'll come back in the morning. Stay on the phone, man. I feel bad. I can't. This thing's so serious. Solid, solid. Dry like a drain. Yeah, okay, so I'm riding with you. You ain't about to go by yourself. <laughs> I said, come on. I said, I'm riding with you. I said, come on in. Yeah, that's the truck. Yeah. I got the road. I'm going to put a solid. He <clears throat> took care of that truck. He put everything on that truck. All right, fam. We just pulled off from the bank, man, a minute ago. Uh, got the cashier's check for this truck. Now we heading back out here to... Uh, where the truck is located at. Um, then uh, he wanted he want us to go to his bank to deposit everything, make sure everything official, and then we're going to uh, notarize the check there and everything. So we're going to get everything in order, and we're going to be bringing this truck back to uh, back to the yard, y'all. Another truck added to the fleet. Um, like I said before, this is a, this is a great truck, man. I drove it yesterday, as y'all seen, man. It drives smooth. Um, I'm gonna get a good video of driving it back once we uh, take care of business and stuff. So, yeah, uh, POV, I mean, driving it back. Uh, like I said, I've been trying to buy this truck for two years. It's really my first time having a, 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 a real conversation with, uh, with the guy that has a truck. Um, I talk on jobs and stuff. He don't really talk much, man. He be quiet, he nod, he be wave. That's about it. But I actually got to uh, talk to him yesterday, man. He had the serious face on, but. I got him to laugh a couple of times. It was funny because I got him to laugh a couple of times and he tightened right back up. <laughs> like, <laughs> so that was funny. But yeah, it's, it's a good truck. Um, he, the best thing about buying a truck from somebody you know, y'all, or a truck that's been around locally that you know about, he can tell me everything about the truck, man. He said he had the truck for like 18 years now. So he told me almost, he probably didn't tell me everything he did to it, but he told me a handful of stuff he did to it. And, suspension the bushings the rear end the transmission uh, he rebuilt the motor uh, I think he said he rebuilt the motor like in 2016 or something like that or he said he rebuilt the motor when it had a uh, 450,000 miles on it so I think the truck might be at like 600,000 miles now I don't know I can't I can't even remember what the fuck is you doing bro I had tasted Sure it's it's ripping, bro. <laughs> All in the video in the background, just go scratching the box up. Yeah, make sure this dude funny, y'all. My shit, we're getting ready to uh, pick this truck up. So, if any of y'all looking for a truck, man, the best the best trucks to buy, man, is the ones you know about. But you know, them hard to come by. Um, not every day somebody's selling their truck. Like I said, I've been waiting a few years to get this truck. So, it's all working out perfect. So, we don't get this thing back. Y'all, another video of it once we get back to the yard, and uh, make sure y'all stay tuned, man. A lot of y'all, and I looked on the, on the what's the name too. That's what I meant to say. I y'all mean, need to go subscribe, man. Eighty percent of the viewers right now, man. Eighty percent of y'all watching these videos, man, is not even subscribed to the channel, man. So 
pause the video right now, man. Click that little bubble over there. Go over there and uh, like the video and uh, subscribe to the channel, man. Hit that post notification bell, man. That way you get all the updates when we dropping these lit videos, man. And make sure y'all stay tuned. All right, y'all. We done made it back over here. We got to come up with a name for this. Blue we got to come Ivy. up with a name. Blue Ivy. Yep. Blue Ivy. What, what you mean, that uh, you want to really, really, you really want to know, though? I don't know. I, I, you know, I smoke, and they got a snack called Blue Ivy out there. So we're gonna come up with a name for this truck, y'all. It look good, but damn, good. she could be shined up maybe a little bit more. But she clean, super, super, super clean. We already follow him to the bank, title notarized, do the title work, and then uh, we come back and taking her home. And uh, he said he got plenty of parts to give us with it too, so we're gonna load all the parts. He said all the stuff he got in there that's for trucking. And uh, we can have because he is done trucking. So we're going to take whatever we can get out of there, y'all. So we're going to see once we get back. All right, fam, we in action. Finally pulling out of here. He gave us a shitload of parts to go with the truck. So that took us an extra hour, y'all, to get all them parts. But I wasn't going to leave no parts, man. He had all kind of stuff to this truck. So I definitely wasn't leaving that. Parts cost way too much. Man, where the hell out of it? Oh, there you go. Why he ain't just following me out? Give me any catches. So this thing drive yeah, like a dream, y'all. Back to the yard. 
figured I'd show y'all the cab. I don't think I showed y'all the inside of this cab. Like I said, everything is here. Everything is intact. It's got all the buttons, all the gauges, all the gauges work, all the lights work. Yeah, everything work. I just turned all the lights on. Let's see if all the lights work on here, y'all. Super, super windy out here today. Front lights work. I'm sure everything work on here, man. Oh man, kept this truck intact, man. Y'all see all the parts. I'm gonna show y'all all the parts he gave us. He gave us a whole pickup truck load full of parts for this thing. Yeah, all the bed lights look like they working. I can't really see those. It's so bright right here. Tires look good. This truck ready to work, y'all. Back lights working. Yeah, it looks like all the lights is working. Lights, yeah, they all work. So yeah, this was a good pickup, y'all. Happy about this. Big Kenworth T8. Got the Western Star. Got to drop that off. Got Big Western Star off to get painted. Got big T8, y'all. Kenworth. These are all the parts he gave us, y'all. We got brake drums. Damn, that's. I need to pick that up. Hopefully, that ain't spill. That ain't spill out of there. Hey, you got gloves? Pick this up for me real quick. This right here. Told this. Told I don't be driving crazy. What he do? Just let us down. He gave us brake shoes, uh, airbags. Uh, automatic greaser thing to help with the automatic greasing, drop axle of arms, shocks, brake shoes, man, all kinds of stuff. So I'll see what's going on. Back at the shop. Make sure y'all stop what y'all doing with that subscribe button, with that post notification bell, man. Like this video, man. And if y'all like these trucking videos where you're going and buying dump trucks, man, refer back to some of my old videos. This is probably like the Ninth truck I done bought on the channel, I think. It's been like nine or ten. So if you go back to the old videos, man, so I can see, man, we've been buying trucks, selling trucks. And, uh, yeah, got more content on the way. And go subscribe, man. Stop what y'all doing. Go subscribe. Go in the comments. Let me know what y'all want to see next. And go in the comments. Tell me what y'all think about this uh, beautiful blue Kenworth we got. We're going to come up with a name for it here soon. I'll come up with a name for it here in the next few days. So go in the comments. Tell me what y'all think about this truck, man. And stay tuned for the next uh, for the next video, man. It's them Jennings boys.